am the mistress of ceremony. I'm just letting you all come in and join us. And I do apologize for the lateness. We had a lot of technical difficulties. And I am your mistress of ceremony, Goddess Moonlight. And today's episode is sponsored by At The Movies Online. episode, Masturbation and Orgasms, In the Pursuit of Pleasure, A Mature Woman's Perspective. And today's guest host, Eris Moon. Hello, Eris Moon. How are you this evening? I'm doing fabulous, just getting in the mood and setting the tone, and it's been a long, long day, as you know. We all have these long days <laughs> lately. So, let's get into the show. Masturbation and orgasms. In the pursuit of pleasure, a mature woman's perspective. So, <laughs> do you remember your very first one and your very first orgasm? <laughs> Let's jump right into it. Wow, six years ago. So, not in your 20s, not in your 30s, but six years ago. Uh-huh. Hmm, interesting. Let's see. My, I, I had my first orgasm at 19, and then I think I didn't have a, I know I didn't have another one until I was in my 30s. So yeah, and I'm 51 now, so hey. Okay, wait a minute, let me take that back. Let me take that back. <laughs> let me take that back. So I say 16 years ago was the very first time I was able to squirt. Okay. <laughs> Let's get into it. Ain't nothing but to do it but to get into it. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Mm. Let me see. My first experience with that was in my 40s. Because mm-hmm. uh-huh. I'm just a little shy over 50. So, yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So, um, yeah. That's been, you know, the experience and whatever. But what I can say is I am not a fan of masturbation. No? No, I am not. Why is that? Um, let's just say to me it doesn't give me the same something that being with another human being does. I don't know. I just I just have never gotten into it. Um, it's just not my thing. I'd rather have human touch, human contact. That's my thing. You know, I like the warmness of a body. You know, okay. caressing me here and there and everywhere. <laughs> okay, okay. So... 
yeah, that's just been my experiences. And um, I feel like it's the pursuit of pleasure because from the time you have your first orgasm to the next time, it's always the pursuit of like getting that next high. So it's always taboo. How do I regain that first feeling that I had the very first time? And um, it's been that pursuit of pleasure for me, the pursuit of pleasure. So sometimes it's just like, don't even bother at all. Because what's the point, you know? You want to you wanna get that moment of pleasure. Yeah. So. And I know they have a lot of, you know, toys out now that, you know, everybody. I, I, I think the rolls or something like that. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, I'm hearing a lot about that. I'm hearing well, a lot. I don't have, but okay. <laughs> I said you don't have that one. Hmm. I don't. I don't have. <laughs> I don't have that one. I'm hearing a lot of good things about it, but no, I. I, have I just that. feel like it doesn't give you the like. I want to be in a, you know, a partner. I don't know if I. You know, that's. You know, it, it's funny because I hear men say things like, um. I know you got something in your drawer next to your bed. Right, right, and I'm right. like, no, I don't. I'm not going to waste my money on toiletries. That's 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 not an essential for me. But you know, see, I like them. Oh, you like them. I don't I don't I don't I don't like to search, but I do like the uh stuff that you of it. Okay. Yeah. I got you. So, yeah. ladies so and gentlemen, like we're going to take a break because in order to see the rest of this video, you will have to stay tuned <laughs> because Ooh. it gets deeper yeah, and deeper. Do.